Hello everyone. Welcome to RRDI Prep. My name is Samir. In this video, we are going to cover a travel route puzzle of excellent puzzle from the previous year CAT paper. So this is a set from the CAT 2017, which we are going to cover in this session. Let's have a look at the instruction part. Four cars need to travel from Akala to Bakala. Two routes are available, one via Mamur and the other via Nanur. The road, <laughs> the roads from A to M and from N to B are both short and narrow. In each case, one car takes six minutes to cover the distance and each additional car increases the travel time per car by three minutes because of congestion. For example, if only two cars are traveling from A to M, each car takes nine minutes. What is the meaning of it? See that. But you are going, uh, the routes, the cars are, cars are traveling from a city A, right, to another city B. And there are two routes available. One is via M and one is via M, right. Now, the routes from A to M and N to B are both short and narrow. That means A to M route is short and narrow. At the same time, N to B is also short and narrow. And each case, a car takes six minutes. That means if a car is traveling from A to M, the car will take six minutes to travel. But an additional car increase the travel time per car by three minutes. That means one if one car is traveling from A to M, it will take six minutes. But if two cars are from A to M, let's say if two cars are traveling, then the time of this traveling from A to M gets increased by three per minute on every additional car. So if one additional car is going, going here from A to M, let's say two cars are going, two cars are going, that means one additional car. So one additional car will increase the time by three, uh, three minute per car right three minute per car so the time would be six plus three that is nine minute right and if two cars are traveling let's say if from a to m three cars are traveling then the time will get increased by three minute per car so every car will be taking three plus three plus three that is 12 minute right so that's the meaning of the statement here our uh, and uh, further it says that on the road from a to n one car take 20 minutes from a to n the time traveling is 20 uh, the time taken by per car is 20 minute and at each additional car increases the travel time by per, per uh, by one minute so every additional car increase the time here by one minute every additional car increase the time here by three minute right and further it says on the road from M to B, one car takes 20 minutes. So from M to B, the car is taking 20 minutes to travel. And each additional car increases the travel time by 0 0.9. So here, every additional car increases the time by 0 0.9 minute, right? 0 0.9 minute. This is the increment in the time because of every additional car. Now, N to B, what is the increase in the time? Let's look at here. You see that. From, if you look at from the time from N to B here, right? Uh, right, that's it. Increase the travel time per, per minute per congestion, right? For example, so, okay. So you see that here in each case, in each case, whether you're going from A to M or N to B, the car is taking six minutes and every additional car increase the time for three minutes. So the word each is mentioned here. In each case means A to M, six minute, additional car will add three minute. N to B, six minute, additional car will add three minute. Okay. Now the question says the police departments order each car to take a particular route in such a manner that it is not possible for any car to reduce its travel time by not following the order while the other cars are following the order. How many cars would be asked to take the route A and B, that is Akala, Nanur, Bakala route by the police department? See, the total number of cars mentioned here are four, right? So four cars are mentioned. Now, how many options are available? See that if four cars are there, the total routes available are A, M, B, right? There are only two routes available. Whether a car will follow the route of A and B, or the car will follow the route of A and B. So these are the only two options available 
to any car. Now, four cars are traveling, right? Police department is, uh, police department order each car to take a particular route in such a manner that it is not possible for any car to reduce its travel time, right? So number of cars which is which has been decided by the police in such a way that if any route will leave its route and follow the other route, then it should not be reduced in travel time. Reduce nahi hona this is the condition of the question. The travel time should not get reduced. Okay. Now, if four cars are there, the uh, possible option are there that four cars are using the route of A and B and zero car is using the route of A and B. The second case is three cars are using A and B, one car is using A and B. Third case is two cars are moving from A and B and two cars are moving on A and B. Fourth option is one here, three here. Fifth option is zero here and fourth here. Now, we know that every additional car increases the travel time by three minutes here and three minutes here. Okay. So can I straight away eliminate this option? Can I straight away eliminate this option? This is not a possible case because if four cars are traveling here, then you see that every car will increase the time by three minutes. If every car increase the time by three minutes here from A, M, A to M to B, then one car, let's say if all the four cars are traveling here, if all the four cars are traveling the routes of A and B, then six minutes plus Three additional car will increase the travel time by nine minutes. So from A to M, every car will be taking 15 minutes. And M to B, a normal time is 20 minutes and every additional car 0 0.9. So three additional car will increase the time by 0 0.9 into three. So the, every car will be taking 20, 20 plus 2.7, that is 22.7 minutes. So 15 minutes here and 22.7 minutes here. You see that the total time would be 5 plus 2, 7, 37.7. Now, if instead of taking the route of A and B, one car decided to take this route, you see that the time taken by that car which decided to change a separate route would be 20 plus 6, that is 26, which is way less than this time, right? So even if the time get reduced by 3 and 0 0.9 here, the, by altering the route, the car will be able to reduce the time. So 4, 0 and 0, 4 is not an option that you should go ahead with, right? These are straight away eliminated because in these cases, if a car is using the route of A and B, right? And all the cars are routing from are going from A to N to B and one car decided to use the route of A and B, that car will be able to reduce its travel time. But the condition of the question is, car should not be able to reduce the travel time, right? So therefore, these options are eliminated. Look at, let's look at this option. If I use this option, that three cars are using the route of A and B and one car is using the route of A and B. What will happen in this case? You see, let's check. If I'm, if I'm sending three cars via the route of A and B, see that? If I'm sending three cars via the route of A and B, now three cars while moving from A to N to B, you see that A to N time travel is 20 minutes plus two additional car increase the time by two minutes. So every car will take 20 minutes from A to N. N to B travel time is six minutes, but two additional car will increase the time by six minutes. So the travel time is six plus six, 12, 34 minutes, right? 34 minutes is there. Now, if one car is going here, right? Three cars are going from A and B and one car is using A and B route. That time, uh, time for that one single car will be 26 minutes. Now, let's say instead of this three car, one car started traveling in this case. That means if three are going here and one is going from A to, one car decided to change its route from A to N to B. Instead of A to N to B, the car decided to take the route of A and B. What will be the new travel time? that car will now be taking a time of six minute here plus additional car that means three nine minute plus 20 minute and because of one additional car the time will be 20.9 that is 29.9 and you see that now if three cars are moving here the time is 34 minute per car but if one car decided to change its route to a to m to b the time of that car 
will get reduced down to 29.9. So the time is getting reduced. The question condition is time should not get reduced. So this option is also eliminated. So at the same time, we can also eliminate this option. You are left with only one case that if two cars are traveling here and two cars are traveling here, time traveled by the by the car which is earlier taking the route of A and B but now decided to take the route of A and B will not get reduced. Why so? Let's check it. See that if two cars are using a route of A and B, the traveling time would be 20 plus 1. Why 1? Because of one additional car. Plus 6 plus 3, that is 20. 6 plus 4, 30 minutes. Now, if one additional car decided, one car decided to use the route of A and B, which was earlier using the route of A and B, now that car from A to M to B will take how much time? A, if that car decided to go to A to M to B, the time taken will be 6 plus 6. Why plus 6? Because two additional cars, two are moving to A to M B. Now one car decided to use the route of A M B, so the time would be six plus six minute extra because of additional car, right? Three minute per car, two extra car means six minute extra plus twenty minute here and one point eight minute extra. So total time will now be you see that thirty three point eight. Is the time getting reduced? No, the time is not getting reduced. This is what the question is asking you that if one car instead of using the route of A and B, decided to go via A and B, the time should not get reduced. Is it getting reduced? No, it is not getting reduced. So therefore, there is only one possible case. If two cars are traveling from A and to B, that means police, police must have ordered two cars to use the route of A and B and two cars to use the route of A and B, right? So therefore, because this was a TETA question, options were not available. This has to be the way of thinking. So the answer to the question is two. This is the answer. A simple question, a very simple question of CAT 2017, but you need to understand the meaning of the increase in the time because of the additional car. And you should be able to make these cases. Straight away, these options will be eliminated. It will not take much time to eliminate the case of 4, 0 and 3, 1. And finally, you will be left with only one case, 2 and 2. Right. So this is the answer to the question. First question answer is 2. Thank you so much for watching the video. The four question of the set, which I will be discussing in the upcoming videos. See you then in the next part. Please subscribe to the channel, share it with all of your friends and to attend my live session on Unacademy Plus, use my referral code LRDSMEAR. Thank you.